We are at the Music Makers Festival with Albert Mann himself. How are you doing? You okay? Yeah. I'm. Uh, finally had a, a sip of beer, so I've um, fully I've been, deserved. Yeah, yeah. So fully deserved. I'm, I'm planning on really, you know, w watching the next two acts and having a few beers and relaxing a little bit because it's been up to this point a bit like very hectic and stressful, but it's it's um, good. It's all been good fun. And that's because you're a co-organizer of the festival this uh, itself. So. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. And this is in its second year. Yeah. So how, how's, it go, how's it been going so far and how's it compared from last year? Um, well, it's a different venue from last year. Uh, this year's geared for sound, whereas the last venue we were in was like a theatre space. Right. So the sound's amazing here, but I do love the fact that you've got the separate venue and the pub in this place, so there's that separation between everyone's quiet listening yeah. and then if you want to come out and have a smoke or have a beer you can you can get out and chat to your mates for five yeah. minutes and stuff so yeah it's a, it's a perfect place and you've been doing a lot of uh, promotional stuff you were on the radio yesterday and yeah yesterday was hectic so up early in the morning for a three-hour rehearsal yeah then straight home then straight out again to london live did Goodness. an interview for we, we literally got in they pushed us through the door we went on me and Minoji, and we, we did a 15-minute interview and then we left and then went straight to BBC London wow. uh, with Howard Rose, who's playing yes. tomorrow. Fantastic. And, and Howard and I both played a, a, a song on, on BBC London. Um, yeah, and that was, so it was, it was full on, but it was fun, you know. It's, 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 it's like the adrenaline rush you get from it and, and doing all that. It's, it's, uh, and the talent tonight, well, the talent so far today, shall I say, mm -hmm. coming into tonight, has been fantastic, really. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I've loved the, art, I've loved, like, the artists today playing yeah. so far. I thought they've been brilliant. And quite a few I haven't even met before. So to actually have followed them online and yeah. on you know socials and Facebook and, and seeing videos online, to actually meet them now in person and put a face to the name and kind of get on with them and they're all really nice people as well. So that's always the bonus. Yeah, absolutely. And let's talk a little bit about your music mm -hmm. that you're playing. Um, because you've had quite a, a successful couple of years. I mean, you supported Muse back in 2016. Mm -hmm. Last year, you mm. were featured on the Best Fun Signed in yeah. um, 2017. Yeah. And this year has been quite busy for you. I actually saw you at the NED recently yeah. doing some stuff. So. Yeah, the NED was, that was a fun gig. Did you that enjoy that? Fun. Yeah, yeah, really good, yeah. So it was, it was like um, affiliated with Jack Daniels the night. So they film it as well. So you have like a really nice slick kind of video. So yeah, it's really, really fun, fun gig. Fantastic. And the music that you're playing at the moment is it's part of a... Are you going to be writing new stuff or...? Well, a lot of it is newish stuff. Mm -hmm. um, I played one old song today from an album that I released in 2016 and it was okay. fun to do because I haven't played it for a while. Right. And you know, you think, oh, your old stuff I won't bother with. Like, I'm done with that. I'm, I'm doing new stuff now. But then you listen back to some of it and you're like, oh, that's, I like that one. It was fun. It was a, you know, upbeat song. So I thought we'd, we'd throw an old one in there. Hey, and you're then, running the festival so you can do whatever yeah, you want. <laughs> All you, covers if I wanted. You can put whatever song you want to put in there. <laughs> yeah. And um, where are we going to find you next? Like, where are you playing next? Um, it's uh, playing in November. I'm not sure the exact date. It's near the end of November. Back in London, um, Escargo. It'll be uh, just a solo gig. Yes. And I'll be playing a nice grand piano there. Haven't seen it, but it's always a treat to play on a, a full grand piano. So Absolutely. And um, I love the fact that you're a fellow northerner as well, yeah. coming down, playing in London. Um, what, what kind of brought you down here in the, in the first instance? Um, well, I came down for university. Um, a while back and I just fell in love with the place and the friends all stayed here and I went back to Manchester for a little bit but then I ended up coming back to London and London's like my first home really I've been here probably you know as long as Manchester so yeah. right good we're not talking about age though let's not go there oh no we it? don't go there <laughs> <laughs> Um, do you think we'll be doing this again next year, Music Makers? Yeah, I hope so. Yeah, I was up for it. It's, um, it's a lot of work, but it's, it's worth it. And it, I think it's when you see it in action and you see you know, people in the audience having a good time, yeah. then you're like, oh, you know, I'm, I'm glad to have been a part of that, making people happy and also getting these artists in front of people as well. Um, is, is just a you know it's a, it's a great thing to to help and, and to do. Fantastic! Well, I'm absolutely thrilled that you are thinking about doing it next year. We've also got tomorrow, so yeah. uh, it's just going to be an awesome weekend. Well, thanks um, for hosting, by the way. No worries, yeah. anytime. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'll give you my card for next year. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, all the best. Look forward to seeing you in November. Yeah. And uh, we'll speak to you soon. Yeah. Cheers. All right, man. Thank you.